Microsoft's Kinect has a depth sensor that can tell how far away things are. In this stream, brighter colors are closer and darker ones are farther away. This video will explain how it does this, which is pretty clever, and not how many people initially thought it worked. Suppose you wanted to figure out how far away things were from a camera. How can you tell the difference between a small nearby rabbit and one that's larger but farther away? They both could look the same from the perspective of a camera. This is where a second eyeball or camera can help. If we draw lines from a rabbit to both cameras, they form a triangle so we can calculate how far away the rabbit is using some trigonometry. It's not as simple as just adding two cameras though. You have to make sure you're drawing lines from the same rabbit. If there are two rabbits in the scene, how can I make sure I'm measuring from the same rabbit? And what if the rabbits are all red and the background is red too? The Kinect can actually handle this case. Instead of a second camera, it has an infrared projector that paints the scene with invisible markers like this. Now the rabbits can be differentiated no matter what the colors are. Whenever the camera sees a 1, it knows that object is sitting along the one line from the projector, so we can again triangulate the distance. Likewise, for any other number, it automatically knows its angle too. Now if you take a night vision camera and look at the projection from the Kinect, you won't see a grid of numbers, but rather a random speckle pattern. This accomplishes the same goal though, because no group of specks looks like any other. So the Kinect automatically knows the angle of every group, and can therefore triangulate distances, just like shown before. The downside of this technology is that it can only work indoors because sunlight would wash out the speckle pattern, and similarly, multiple Kinects would confuse each other.